Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to Lavish Gaming. Today I'm going to show you how to install mod packs on the Technic Launcher. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open a web browser such as Chrome or Internet Explorer. And once you open that web browser, you're going to want to go to technicpack.net. Once you're there, you see something similar to this. I am logged in, so it shows me a dashboard. What you want to find is this download button up here at the top. And just click that. Now right here you will see links to download for the Technic Launcher for whatever platform you are on. If you're on Windows, download Windows, OS X if you are on a Mac, and Linux if you are on some sort of operating system that is built on Linux. So I'm on a Mac, so I'm going to click OS X. And in Chrome, it will ask you if you want to keep or discard the file. In Internet Explorer, it will ask you to save the file. I'm going to keep. And then I'm going to open my Downloads folder. Once I have opened the Downloads folder, you can see TechnicLauncher.jar. On a Mac, you have to right-click it and click Open. That is due to certain security settings. It will ask you if you are sure you want to open the Technic Launcher. Click Open. And after a few seconds, the launcher will appear. Alright guys, the launcher has launched, and when it first opens, we will see this. It's asking us to log in with, to our Minecraft account, excuse me. So I'm going to do that now. Now, if you are on a computer that you own, I would sh recommend, excuse me, checking this tick box right here to remember your login information. Now I'm going to click log in. And wow, I got my password wrong. That is embarrassing. Oh my god, I'm failing so hard right now. All the board, the fail express. Alright, there we go. I've remembered my password. Yay. Alright guys, so once the launcher opens, figures if it is your first time, excuse me, opening the launcher, it will open to this discover page. Now the discover page shows the top trending mod packs on the Technic Launcher. Also includes a featured mod pack. And you can click here to find out news and change logs on the Technic Launcher. Now the, the tab we are interested in is the mod packs tab. Now I have downloaded a ton of extra mod packs. Dissension here is my own mod pack. And so these first mod packs here are the only ones you are going to have. These are included with the Technic Launcher and they are created by the Technic Launcher staff. Mine is vanilla. Vanilla is vanilla Minecraft. So to add a mod pack you can either search for it up in this search bar right here. I'm just going to search modded because I know it will show me a ton of mod packs. So now, now that we have found our mod pack that we want, all we have to do is click install down here in the bottom corner and you're pretty much done. Now there's also the option of, excuse me, downloading from the Technic Launcher website. So once you're at the Technic Launcher, go mouse over discover and click browse mod packs. Here you can sort by trending or the most popular mod pack. Currently this Jurassic Park mod pack is the most popular. So if I wanted to install this onto my Technic Launcher, I could click Install this mod pack up here, and it will tell me Platform URL Copy to Clipboard. If for whatever reason it does not copy the link, the link is right here. You can just click in that box and copy it manually. Now we're going to want to go back to our launcher, and we want to paste that link into the search bar. Now as you can see here, we have found the mod pack. Now to install this mod pack, all we have to do is click install once again. Um, that's pretty much all you have to know. I'm, I will show you some extra options. So in launcher options, I would recommend checking show console and start in the mod packs tab. Also in Java settings, you can change, if you have multiple versions of Java installed, you can change what version you want to use, as well as the amount of memory. Also on mod pack option options, excuse me, <laughs> you can well actually excuse me. Yes, if solder is enabled, it will have the option to select a version. So I can see the versions of this pack because it has solder enabled. If the mod pack is installed, for example, I know I have my own mod pack installed. 
I click here beside the open button, it will open the Minecraft folder basically that the mod pack is in. Here I can see my con config folder, my mods, I can add and remove mods here, and also a resource packs folder. And guys, that pretty much concludes this video. I can't think of much more you would need to know. Um, I covered launcher options, mod pack options. That's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below or send me a message on YouTube. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.